Hey folks, welcome to a new Let's Play from Mysterious JG Samurai Warriors Spirit of the Sanada. This is a game that I didn't particularly intend to Let's Play, but I knew it was out there, um, and I was kind of interested in it, and I sort of figured I would put it on my Amazon wish list that people who know me in real life had uh, options of things they could buy me for Christmas. And um, I figured if this was one of the things that I got for Christmas that I wasn't necessarily going to go get for myself, uh, and if somebody bought it for me, that I would let's play it. And that is what has come to pass. I hope that one guy who uh, has like had a Pikachu as his YouTube avatar, who kept like commenting on every video for like a week, please play Spirit of the Sanada. I want you to play Spirit of the Sanada. Are you planning to play Spirit of the Sanada? I hope he's watching and enjoying. Um, although I haven't heard from that person in a long time, because all they ever really did was show up and ask me to play Spirit of the Sanada. They didn't, I don't recall that person doing a whole lot of other comments. So maybe that person's long gone, having given up on me playing Spirit of the Sanada. How sad that would be. Though not as sad as the ultimate... Um, resolution of the story of the sonata if you're going to do a samurai warriors game charting the path of like one family in uh, much greater detail the sonata are not a bad one to choose because they have a pretty interesting story uh, which we will see unfold and i have heard that this game tries to be more historically accurate than some of the other samurai warriors games we'll see exactly what that means because i would imagine they're going to take a lot of license i do know one thing I know that I'm kind of shocked and offended by, but I already happen to know this, is that uh, Inahime does not appear in this game. Um, so that's kind of surprising, but yeah, I believe she has like no role in this game. Um, but this game has no... Uh, this is the title screen, and this, this music is really all we get here, the title screen. So let's start a new game. We are going to start a new game. I started a new game off screen. I didn't get very far at all before just realizing, eh, I better start just actually recording, recording. So we will start a new slot. You can only really have one game going at a time. They don't support multiple slots. I'm going with all of the defaults. Show NPC costume changes, okay. I'm just going with all the defaults, because other than playing for like five minutes off screen, I haven't played the game at all. Samurai Warriors 4, to save data has been detected. 10,000 gold and glittering gold ore times 10 will be added to your inventory. Samurai War Samurai Showdown 4-2, save data. 10,000 Sanada Clan X and 5 conch shells will be added to your inventory. Samurai Warriors 4 Empire, save data has been detected. 5 conch shells and fresh seeds times 10. Don't know what any of those do. Hey, how come I'm not getting credit for uh, Muso Stars? I guess it's only the pure Samurai Warriors games that count. Maybe Warriors Orochi 4 Ultimate would have counted if I had that game, which I don't. It was another one that was on my uh, Amazon list, but it was not purchased for me. Well, this one was. So I believe we are flash f forwarding uh, to near the end of the overall story and are then are going to jump back to the beginning of the story which is and now we have this this series first ever actual attempt to age characters who you know age I think that's Mazuki not Mazuki I mean um never mind I'm a blonde woman in Japan that's a big thing that happens a lot in these games Nobuyuki, I meant, not, uh, yeah. We'll get to know a lot more Sanada clan members than we, uh, have in previous games. Namely, this guy, Mazuyuki, who will be beginning the game as. And yeah, no English dub, which annoys the piss out of me. Nani? I said Nani! Hey, Nani Nani! Now loading six golden coins. I guess they're golden. I don't really know for sure. Oh, it's the 
the theme of the Witcher on it. She can talk at his fourth son, Katsuyori. How could a full moon be uh, a bad sign? You think werewolves are going to come? Oh, it's auto playing. I didn't mean for to do that. I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh, Lord. Dot, 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 dot. The same in any language. Even as a little kid, uh, Katsuyori is wearing the crazy hat. He's not looking. Fog is likely to appear, causing a mass accident on Highway 64. I would think fog would be like an opportunity for us to trick the enemy, but also for them to trick us. Hi. What's going on with the skunk hairstyle there, Mazuyuki? AKA <laughs> <laughs> okay. Actually, I didn't say anything of the sort. Uh, you're reading a whole lot into my blank expression here. I'll never make that mistake again. This is a really tough uh, LP for Zerfall, where he inclined to follow it, because he'll have to read the dialogue. Can't really do the, watch this one while doing the dishes. I hope we get to meet Shingen in this game. I, Shingen's a character I wish we saw. Like, his Samurai Warriors 2 incarnation is really fun. I wish we got to see more of him in these games. <laughs> no wonder people enjoy cosplaying as him. Oh man, you're really building up. It's going to be really sad when you get, like, totally murdered later, Katsuyori. しかるべき戦が用意されましょう。そうだな。分を祈るぞ、マサイキ。父上を頼む。みんな、ほら。この月、上杉にとっての今日にしてみせましょう。今日にしてみましょう。申し上げます。I bring generic news. I'm generic soldier. What up? Oh, we got a new narrator. A lady narrator. So yeah, I guess, I guess I'm not going to read this over the Japanese dialogue, but... We've got some recycled art of uh, Shingen and Kenshin anyway. I wouldn't mind, I wouldn't mind a game where you play as the uh, Uesugi, actually. Spoiler alert, he's going to be Yukimura's dad. Yeah, that's the famous Nobuyuki Sanada and the even more famous Yukimura Sanada. The Uesugi army is on the move, and we're getting ready to participate as a retainer of the Takada in uh, one of their final great battles against the Uesugi. It's part of the rivalry between uh, Shingen Takada, the Tiger of Kai, and Kenshin Uesugi, the Dragon of Echigo who just fought each other a whole bunch and basically held each other in check so that neither of them could ever really expand and take over the whole country. I knew it was coming sooner or later. This means Yukitaka may have issued an order. Oh, but here we can get speaker info. Katsuyori Takada, Shingen Takada's fourth son. He was a young man with a kind heart and an even temper. He was good friends with Mazuyuki, who is one of Shingen's closest advisors, and although they were of different statuses, they became close friends. He greatly respected his father and hoped one day equal his father's grand and magnificent presence. Uh, that didn't really end up happening. Although he was quick to help people alleviate their pain and sadness, he was always reluctant to speak of his own hardships. He loved things that were sweet and delicious and could be used as a weapon. A weapon? 
And that's... This This game is going to give us a lot of extraneous information on characters. You must go to him. Be prepared for your first real battle. Understood. Mazuyuki Sanada won. Yuki Mura... Sorry, Yuki Taka Sanada's third son. The father of Lady Muramatsu, Nobuyuki, and Yuki Mura. As one of six young servants, he served by Shingen Takata's side, where he was unable to hide his respect and admiration for Shingen. Why would he be trying to do that? Whatever. Although he and Shingen's son, Katsuyori, were of different statuses, they became rather close friends. He loved his family, but because he could not openly express it, he was often teased by his older brother, Mazuteru, and others. He was especially awkward at dealing with his children and had troubles dealing with Lady Muramatsu. That was what he's like, Captain Picard. He revered his local shrine, considering it to be a place of great importance. The Castle Town. In the Castle Town, you can advance the progress of the story by speaking to and interacting with officers and townspeople, and by accepting and clearing tasks. Take a look around the town and see what you can find. We are in Sanada Main Castle. People are running right by us. Please give my best to Yuki Taka. Here's a regular soldier. I bring news. The Uesugi army is on the move. Okay. It'll be a nuisance if the fog does not arrive. It's Masateru, son of a... He said something about fog, didn't you? I hope it will not affect our battle against Uesugi. This is Yukitaka Sanada's second son, therefore our older brother. As an officer, he demonstrated great skill in an effort not to be outdone by his older brother, but he could also be quite frivolous. He was sensitive and could easily be moved to tears, which usually caused Masayuki to become exasperated with him. His family was extremely important to him, and he considered fighting on their behalf to be a tremendous honor. It is said he liked animals that shared his personality. Is any of this actually going to be apparent in the game itself? Is this just a bunch of nonsense we're going to read? We must be fully aware of the characteristics of the train and be alert for surprise attacks, otherwise we could end up being routed. Looked at another way, these are all things we can take care of before the battle. The fate of this battle depends on our skill and preparation. We could take care of the fog before the battle. Oh, I just got a coin. The six coins of the Sanada. By completing tasks and gathering information, the six coins of the Sanada will be filled. Six coins can be used in the execution of stratagems in later battles, which will help the lead the allied forces to victory. This will be an extremely important source of power for the Senate and their struggles to survive through this age of war. To prepare for the difficult battles ahead, make sure to gather as much information and complete as many tasks as you can. Townspeople who may hold the key to unlocking the strength of the six coins of the Senate will be marked with the six coins icon. Talk to them and find out what they have to say. Here what Captain Planet has to say. Kawakanajima's weather. I should probably write something about that in the Chronicles. I may be able to gather some information if I talk to people. That makes sense. The more information I have, the greater the understanding of my situation I may achieve. Whenever a problem arises, I must remember to talk to the people first. Spam talking to everyone. During conversation with the Castle Towns, you'll find out more about your conversation partner, what they're talking about. And there's Clan Chronicles. Yukitaka Sanada. Oh, he's, he was mentioned by somebody else. He's our dad. He served Shingen Takada, and due to his unique talent, he was trusted and treated as an equal to the hereditary vassals, despite starting as an outsider, like Nash and Hall. He trusted his sons implicitly and knew he could always count on them. Following the Takada army's great defeat at Toishi Castle, he devised a plan for taking down the castle on a single day, which led to him being praised for his offensive tactics in battle. The time he spent with his young children in the flower garden... That was like thick yellow carpeting was one of his fondest memories. He loves yellow carpeting. The Uesugi clan rules over Echigo, present-day Niigata pre Prefecture. Its primary ruler during the Sengoku period was Kenshin Uesugi. It was a family that deeply valued the concept of righteousness. The long-running battle of Kawakanejima caused powerful families to seek Kenshin's assistance with when Shinao... Shinananananao, present-day Nagano Prefecture, was attacked by Shingen, which led to big changes for the clan. In actuality, Echigo is plagued by civil war, with numerous retainers rising up in rebellion, but Kenshin's godlike strength and charisma helped him to unite the region. Oh. Weather. It was believed that the humidity at Kawakanejima was quite high due to being surrounded by rivers. Therefore, there was often a fear that it would become a quite foggy on days, where there was no wind once the temperature dropped overnight. 
It was said that a thick fog covered the battlefield when Shingen and Kenshin dueled during the fourth battle of Kawakanejima. We're gonna duel. It'll soon be time to duel. Hey, there's a soldier. There's a flashing light. It is a shriveled seed. Dried and wrinkled seeds. Faint vestiges of life. Whatever. I guess I used them in crafting somewhere along the line. I don't understand still the whole skunk cut with the half black, half white hair. Lord Mazuyuki, they say there's a strange woman in the Yosugi ranks. You must mean Aya. She's the elder sister of the head of the clan, Kenshin Uesugi. Aya, elder sister of Kenshin Uesugi, the daimyo of Echigo. She was a modest and refined woman known for her graceful demeanor. She was a guiding light for the Uesugi clan, serving as a kind and soothing presence to its officers despite her sometimes harsh methods. Kenshin Uesugi, the 16th ruler of the Uesugi clan, referring to himself as the physical embodiment of Bishamontan, his exploits on the battlefield led him to be feared as a god of war. And he had several games about him. He constantly sought a greater truth through warfare, causing him to be a lonely and isolated man who really only felt at home on the battlefield. This meant that he rarely displayed emotion, instead expressing himself through the act of warfare and drinking. He was a big drinker. Known as the Dragon of Echigo, he faced his nemesis, Shingen Takada, who was given the nickname Tiger of Kai, in battle multiple times at Kawakanejima. They say she combines strict discipline with loving forgiveness and is revered by the officers of the Yusuke. She is not the kind of person who wants your enemy. I see, then I pray I do not come across her on the battlefield. Thanks for talking to me, player character. Oh, I get to run. Hooray, hooray! What are you guys hooraying about over here? Whatever, apparently nothing I get to interact with. Ooh, here's somebody with coin power. Mr. Saito will be crucial. Mm. Not Saito. Here's the eldest son of Yuki Taka. He possessed tremendous emotional or tremendous responsibility because he was the oldest. Trying to set a good example. Thoughtful and loyal officer. Sometimes went hunting with his younger brother. He preferred red pal I don't think any of this will ever matter. Kaizu Castle is a castle of the, Takeda, of the Takeda that Shingen Takeda ordered Kanzuke Yamamoto to build. Nowadays, <laughs> interesting choice of words, it's referred to as Matsuhiro Castle. It was built along the Chikuma River in Chinao now. And it was well defended due to being surrounded by mountains on three sides. The first castle lord was Mazanobu Kosaka, and at the fourth battle of Kawakanejima, it functioned as an important strategic location. Mount Saijo is a somewhat small mountain located near Kawakanejima. The Usugi army took up position here during the fourth battle of Kawakanejima. Its name came from a story spread during the Edo period about the soldiers of the Usugi army were fond of weeping due to the missing their wives. Because I guess the name means something about weeping. Near Kaisi Castle is a mountain called Mount Saijo, claiming the higher ground as a fundamental time of strategy, but... Since you Usuki are already on the move, they will have claimed Mount Saijo before us. Yes, it is most unfortunate when we start this battle at disadvantage. But that gives us coin power. I should write in the Sanada Chronicles about the topography of Kawakanejima. Which you can read about if you want to. There's just a lot of text in this game, isn't there? Find your interaction with the castle towns, other information concerning historical events, relationship between the clans, the characteristics of the land in which Mazuyuka and his family live will be added to the Sanada Clan Chronicles. Some interesting information can be obtained from surprising sources. Don't be shy about speaking to everyone you meet. As I begin to wonder whether we're going to run into some of the characters in this game have nothing to do with the Sonata. Oh, history is bustling. bustling. The tension is palpable. Once the battle against the Uesugi begins, demand for my services is sure to increase. That's a good way to look at it. <laughs> That's not what he said. He said... He, I heard him say Mazuyuki, but the subtitles... Can't wait to head into battle. This is Yoritsune Yuzawa, our uncle. He was adopted by the Yuzawa clan, was hostile to Sanada, and helped resolve the differences between the Sanada and the Yuzawa. When he was with the Sanada clan, he did not get along well with his older brother and constantly fought him, but it was said he understood his brother's hardships after being adopted by the Yuzawa and tried to make peace with him. The subject of their fights was usually that of youth, youthful brashness. They did not go into specifics. Apparently, the rift between them was quite large. He was determined to give his all in order to help the Sonic Clan, despite his fierce nature. He said he was like a completely different person whenever he saw a delicate flower. 
Lord Katsuyuri is here. Yes, I was with him until a short while ago. He encouraged me. He has high hopes for you. I understand. Yeah. You know, that guy's over there pumping his fist. He's like, yeah. We're gonna go into battle with the Usugi. It's pretty heavy score. Suppose you think you're special, hmm? I am the player character. Listen to me, son of a boy. I know it's your first battle, but you need to keep your head. No silly panicking, understand? The Sanada clan is our clan. Although their history is talking to retainers is brief, they were highly trusted by Shingen. They joined... Oh, I guess they uh, joined Shingen uh, because he gave them back the territory that had been stolen by Shingen's father. Nobutora, Shingen, another guy with an interesting life, although most of the Samurai Warriors series is set in the like latter years of Shingen's life. It is thought that the six coins of the family crest were meant to serve as a sign that Yukitaka was willing to give his life in service of the Takata clan. Six Mon coins were the fare required to take the ferry across the river to the afterlife, proving the Sano were ready to give up their lives on the battlefield if needed. Meanwhile, this guy is one of the 24 generals of the Takata, highly respected, blah, blah, blah. He was the wild tiger of Mount Kubuto. That's his favorite Pokemon as well. Uh, I see him somewhat overbearing. But it may have been an effort to help Mazuyuki overcome his nerves, or maybe he just hates us because he thinks he's better than us. I don't want you slowing down the rest, slowing down the rest of the Sonata troops, or worse still, the rest of us. Have no fear. None of the Sonata clan are foolish enough to allow dreams of glory to cloud our vision. Kuro's visions of power. This will put an end to near decades-long feud. Sure, we've fought them like 20 times. This battle will certainly settle it. Father, we received word from a messenger that. Actually, I want to make him talk like he does in Samurai Warriors, too. Father, we received word from a messenger that the Uesugi are on the move. Are there any orders for me? Because there's like four or five different generic officer types in Samurai Warriors 2. Uh, the last Samurai Warriors game that I played that was actually dubbed into flippin' English. And Mazuyuki was portrayed as old man strategist guy, so he talked like that. Yokikana. Your instincts are good, Mazayuki. There is a command for you directly from our great lord himself. Shingen Takada, the 19th ruler of the Takada clan. He wielded his battle fan while crafting cunning schemes that led his forces to victory. Known as the Tiger of Kai, he faced his nemesis, Kenshin Uesugi, who was given the name of the Dragon of Echigo, and battled multiple times at Kawakanajima. Constantly calm and intelligent, he possessed a bright and jovial nature, earning him the respect of his retainers. The Japanese characters displayed on his battle fan are said to have come from a similar concept originally taken from Sun Tzu. Meanwhile, though, this is our dad. He served Shingen Takada and due to his unique talent, who's trusted and treated as an equal to the hereditary vassals, despite sparting as, starting as an outsider. He trusted his sons. We already read that, actually. Never mind. You were to transport supplies to Kaizu Castle. It was a key stronghold for the Takada. To me about the Takada, a clan that ruled over Kai, present-day Yamanashi Prefecture, and Shinano, a present-day Nagano prefecture. Its ruler during a large part of the Sengoku period was Shingen Takada. It engaged the Uesugi clan and battled multiple times at Kawakanajima. It also formed an alliance with the Hojo clan, which ruled over Kanto, and the Imagawa clan, which ruled Suruga, a portion of present-day Shizuoka prefecture. So yeah, the alliance, there was like a three-way alliance between the Uus, the sorry, the um, Hojo, the Imagawa, and the um, Takada is what actually gave uh, the Imagawa clearance and security enough to march out of their lands towards Kyoto, which uh, ultimately led to them being um, completely crushed, like in a shocking and unexpected turn of events at Okahazama, I believe is the name of the battle. They got Mortified by Nobunaga, which started Nobunaga's career as a conqueror, basically. So, we're going to transport supplies. As long as you can escort the supplies as far as the northern checkpoint in the Sanada Homeland, the troops in the Kaiser Castle will be able to take them from there. Sanada Homeland. This area began as an undeveloped woodland near the Sanada Main Castle. Blessed with abundant natural resources, the area contained many wild animals. Though it was occasionally attacked by bandits, it was close to the castle town, so it was relatively safe. Do you wish to accept the task supplies for the Takata? Sure. Yes, sir. I will carry out this mission. Here is your stipend. Make your preparations together with Nike. 
Naiki Takanashi, retainer under Mazuyuki. Although he was often somewhat careless, his hard work and devotion earned the trust of Mazuyuki and many other members of the Sano clan. Although his bright and optimistic nature was often misunderstood, he possessed a genuine sympathy for others. For some reason, he was quite fond of Killifish. Why wouldn't he be? Whatever. Called by the blacksmith to get what you need. You cannot go out of the battlefield empty-handed after all. Blacksmith. This is what a blacksmith is. You can read about it. <coughs> Transport supplies as far as sign of the homelands north of the checkpoint in preparation for battle against the U.S.C. You're na now able to explore the sign of the homeland. But a task, assign the task of transport supplies. Prepare the supplies together with Nike, Takarashi, on your way. You may find yourself under attack from brigands or soldiers of the Yusugi. Procure weapons of the blacksmith to prepare for any such attacks. This will be our fourth class Yusugi. I would like to think the time has come to settle this for good, but dot dot dot. Have faith, Father. Have faith, Father. Our strength will be enough to conquer the Yusugi this time. Mazuki, you've grown up so much. There's no greater joy than to see one's sons develop into fine men. Sorry that you had to wait for your fourth son before that happened for you, Father. I think I will write in the sign of the Clan Chronicles about the enmity between the Uesugi and the Takada. Enmity between the Uesugi and the Takada. This was caused by the Uesugi invading Takada controlled territory due to the many people who were driven out of Shinano by the Takada. The Uesugi army was led by the Dragon of Echiko, which we've read about repeatedly. That gave me more coin power. And now we're gonna meet this guy. Ooh! 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 Young Master, I had a feeling you needed me, so I came straight away. Oh. We've been ordered to transport some supplies. We must prepare the supplies at once. Supplies! You can read about what supplies do. Jesus Christ, man, really? It's not even like a it's not even like a a game mechanic tutorial. It's like here's a glossary entry on what supplies actually represent in the real world. Indeed, your master, I'm fully aware of the task with which you've been entrusted. Now I'm starting to talk like Bane. Preparations are already in place. We need to transport the supplies as quickly as possible and hurry to the proof field. You are getting ahead of yourself, Mikey. Is that really your name? We must first focus on the mission in front of us. I will leave Nike to prepare the supplies for transportation. I need to make my own preparations. His father told me to call by the blacksmith. And so we shall. I believe talking to any of these guys will bring up the same dialogue as before. Yeah. It sure is, buddy. Quality weapon could all be created from the metals of superior quality. Also, seeds, apparently. So we will buy a whop it. Apparently we got a thousand gold at some point, because I got ten thousand from having other games. And the only thing available is the six coins flag, which has no skills. It's just a generic weapon. So we will fight with the six coins battle flag. May the gods smile upon you on the battlefield. You've acquired and equipped a new weapon. By defeating enemies in battle, your weapon's proficiency level increases. Once proficiency reaches a certain threshold, your weapon's rank will increase. Weapons do stuff. Preparations are complete. It's time to head for the Sanada homeland. Leaving town! You can now leave town through the town gates. Press X at the gate to display the map of Japan. You will travel further and visit battlefields and towns other than the Sanada main castle. Hmm. Is that a supply unit? Hmm. Lord Katsuyori. Oh, I missed the chance to read about supply units in my, um... Oh no, I didn't read about supply units. No, I'll never have a complete chronicle. Oh, well, it looks like uh, we're probably just going to have to start over uh, the game because I think we can't get 100% completion now because I didn't read about supply units. At any rate, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed. In the next video, we will actually have gameplay. I promise. See you then.